Hey guys, Gene Graves here. Um, so, um, if you haven't seen it yet, go over and watch it. It looks like a great idea. Um, more so on like uh, the budgeting part and um, just kind of being fun. I, I mean, I guess you could almost look at it like a, a Candyland board game. Um, but if you go over to Bizarre Individuals, um, page and, uh, look at the gel challenge. Sorry, it's not a challenge. It's supposed to help you budget, but you know, everything's a challenge to me. So, um, but it looks really fun. So I think I'm going to put one together and let you guys know about it later on. Um, you know, and it's supposed to be a gel. Um, but the other thing is I always see stuff as being fun. Um, and all that. So probably what I will do is, um, make mine almost like a board, um, like a board game and stuff and, um, do that. And at the end of it, um, it'll help me budget basically, um, hopefully for the most part, um, but also help me read through some manga. And then at the end of it, maybe as like a prize system, um, after I go through, um, you know, getting pluses for doing things and minuses for not doing things or whatever, um, then we can, um, you know, like get a new series or something, something cool. Um, you know, like that, sorry, I had a comment come up, um, you know, but something cool like that. So, um, I think I'm going to do that and, um, make it really cool. I'll pick like a series that I want. Um, you know, uh, and kind of incorporate different stuff onto it, um, as far as, um, just little things, um, you know, like reading, um, for a point or something like that, just something a little, really cool, um, you know, especially if we are playing it like a board game, yeah, you know, because, I mean, there's a gel in Monopoly, we'll just say that, you know, and that's a board game, so, um, you know, like I said, though, we will, uh, do that and go forward with, uh, what we are going to do and get, um, maybe I can finally get, um, some of the series that I want. Um, some of them I haven't gotten series yet for it because, um, there's always something more that I want. So I think it would also help me like set a goal of, uh, me picking out like a specific series that I want and then getting it. Um, I haven't gotten Black Butler yet, which I really wanted. It's been a really long time since I saw it and wanted it. Um, but I haven't been able to get it because then I kind of look at how many books I have to get for the series and how much they cost. I'm kind of like, oh, I'll just, I'll just hold off. Um, you know, so we have some different stuff. Um, I also need to get the, uh, fruits baskets, but I'm going to get the omnibus for it. So hopefully maybe I can do that too and put that on there as, um, after I get such and such through all the way to the end of the, um, game board or whatever, or the jail, um, you know, getting all the way through it to the very end and getting a prize from it. So, um, you know, but like it is, um, it's supposed to help you budget and do all that stuff. Um, on top of, um, my pre-orders that I already get, um, which I would get those regardless. Um, I would probably do this for older series or stuff that I haven't even started yet or even gotten. Um, so really good stuff. Um, you know, so hop over to Bazaar's page. If you want to see that, um, you can wait and see mine later on. Um, I know he's going to kind of fix his up a little bit and, um, change it up a little bit so that he can do that. And, uh, I know I'm going to put a lot of pressure on myself to, um, make it where it's not easy for me because if it's like, uh, you know, the Spartan challenge that we just got done last month and reading 70 volumes in a month or whatever, well, never mind, that's kind of hard. <laughs> um, you know, but like getting through a certain number or whatever and getting points off of it, like reading one book and all that, if it was like, you know, 50 or whatever, um, you know, I could, build up enough points really fast, um, reading and doing whatever else is going to be on there to buying series all the time anyway. So, uh, I'm 
probably going to try and put a lot of restraint on myself to um, get certain series and whatnot. So, anyway. Um, it is a really cool idea, though. Um, pop over to his shelf. He actually got it from somebody else. Um, I think their YouTube name is Drinking by My Shelf. Maybe. I'm pretty positive that's it, but not positive enough that I, I wouldn't say that uh, I might be a little wrong. So, um, anyway, though, just pop over to his page, look at it. He also put hers on there and um you can see both of them and then later on hopefully you'll get to see mine and we'll get to see bazaar's uh remade um of his rules and stuff um you know that way we can get a better idea of how to do it and figure out how we want to um do a gel a game board anything else like that or um maybe a treasure map maybe that's what it can be so anyway, I just wanted to make a quick video about it. It looked really cool. And I was like, whew, I got some stuff to do to figure out how to do this and get ready to uh, kind of plan it out and um, help my budgeting and whatnot. So anyway, guys, I will catch you later. Jen Graves signing out. Bye.